A number of business owners in Monroe County spent the day assessing the damage and cleaning up after being hit by smash and grab thieves overnight. Police say at least five businesses were struck. Two of the cars, they say, were ditched at the scene. Christian Garzon joins us now in studio with more on all of this. Christian. Well, there's a call now for more police on the streets in the early morning hours with folks asking what the reasons behind these behaviors are. One man, assuming these are young people, said it all starts at home. Tuesday morning, News 8 spoke with Jesus, who used to own this building when it was a pet shop. It's now the Park Slow clothing store. He was here helping to clean up. He said this is all too familiar. The neighborhood, what you gonna do? You know, these kids. I don't care, but if I catch him, I swear to God. Jesus says the crooks made off with about $500 worth of clothing, and the doors here are going to cost upwards of $5,000 to fix. Insurance isn't going to cover the cost for the owner. This community sucks, man. You know, I, I really wanted to move out to Henrietta or somewhere beautiful, you know, Pittsburgh, where I don't have to worry about this. But it sucks that you have to leave your own hood, your own community because you can't take this no more. In addition to this, police said Monday into Tuesday, four other locations were hit, including Dunkin' Donuts on the 700 block of Lake Ave, Joe's Quick Mart on West Ridge, the My Way station on Emerson, and here, the Rock 7 convenience store on Dewey Ave. James Burtz heard the car break through the doors early in the morning. We got to come together and, and try to respect and enjoy each other. And until we do that, man, I think this is just going to be a, 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 a steamroller thing, you know? One employee of Rock 7 who wanted to remain anonymous said he hopes to own his own store one day, but all this is making him think twice. Leaving in the pandemic, it happened in the pandemic, uh, looters, all of that. Y'all had y'all fun then and there. Like, now it's just messing with people's livelihoods. Jesus said the people smashing and grabbing choose early morning times because they know police aren't going to be out in large numbers. These young boys now these days, they got no morals, no families, their mom and dad's not there for them, so they out here doing this. Now, police say two Hyundais used in the smash and grabs were found at Joe's Quick Mart and Duncan. There are no suspects in custody. Adam Theresa, right back to you.